On this lesson, we want to graph a quadratic equation by plotting points. The first method for graphing a quadratic equation is by plotting points. All equations that can be put in the standard form ax squared plus bx plus c equals zero will be the u-shaped parabola. A minimum of five sets of ordered pairs is usually suggested. So if we have y equals x squared minus 4x plus 4, let's pick some arbitrary points for x, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. Let's find if we let x equal 0, what's the value of y? So we have y equals 0 squared minus 4 times 0 plus 4, 0, 0 equals 4. So that means if x is 0, y has a value of 4. Let's try another one. Let's let, y, let's let x equal 1. Then y equals 1 squared minus 4 times 1 plus 4. So we have 1 minus 4 plus 4. That gives us a value of 1. So we have 1 and 0 and 1 and 4. Let's plot the points. We have 0, 4. We have 1, 1. We have 1, 1. Notice the y coordinates, each space is, stands for 2. If x is 2, y is 0. If x is 3, y is 1. If x is 4, y is 4. So if we complete the graph, we get a parabola. It looks like a u. And we label it y equals x squared minus 4x plus 4. Let's now try the equation y equals negative x squared minus 5. Again, if I select arbitrary values for x, negative 2, negative 1, 0, 1, and 2. If x is negative 2, I have negative. Negative 2 squared minus 5. Negative, negative 2 squared is 4. So I have negative 9. So if x is negative 2, y is negative 9, so negative 2. Let's try another one. If x is negative 1, then I have negative 1 squared minus 5, negative. Negative 1 squared is 1, gives me negative 6. Negative 1, negative 6, if x is 0, is negative 5, negative 6, and negative 9. So once again, if I complete the graph, this is an upside down parabola. Write y equals negative x squared minus 5. Turns out if the number in front of x squared is a negative, it will be opening down which makes it a little easier to know what we're looking for. In this lesson, we graphed a quadratic equation by plotting points. In a subsequent lesson, we'll have more information and maybe have a better way of coming up with our x and y values.